Hey guys, I'm LB, and welcome to my critique of the movie Passengers, a film from 2016. Uh, no, uh, wrong window. Welcome to my playthrough of Passenger, a map by Hugo B. Designer from 2017. Medium. All passengers aboard the funnel ride. Welcome to Passenger, a medium difficulty monoportal map with two distinct funnels. What is this visit the main page link? Why is this hovering over my screen? What are you doing, Steam? And yes, it's good to be back after such a long break. Feedback and criticism is appreciated as always, and let me know if you think you found an unintended solution or exploit. Have fun! Thanks to Hanky Mueller for playtesting. P.S. I'm aware it's possible to skip part of the puzzle by quickly... Okay. Yes, gotcha. Let us begin. Hello. This does a lot of things. This is a whole lot of things. So this turns off a fizzler. It turns off a light bridge. And it turns on a reversed funnel. That's a lot of things. What is our mono portal leave? Uh lead. Sorry. <laughs> you thought I wouldn't be able to do that. But I did. Okay. We got this. Got this. What else? Hmm. What does this side do? Interesting. So this... is required for the exit. It turns on... a funnel going in the same direction as that funnel. And... turns off that fizzler. Hmm, interesting. What does this do? Ah, this is how we start the map. Well, that makes sense. Yes, that makes a lot of sense, actually. So now we head back over here, and we step on this button for a little while. And step off. There we go, that works. Ha! I always want to try that. Just in case, because it's fun. Right, so now we have a cube over here, and we can put the cube on the button. This other button's not too interesting. Oh, actually it is. Hmm. Oh, it turns on a light bridge, huh? Interesting. Alright, well anyway, we have this now. So. It would appear to me... that what we need to do is fizzle this. Yes, there we go. Aha! Excellent. So now we have it in here. And I guess we just want to drop it, right? Or maybe not. I'm actually not sure. We want to get it... in there, right? I think we might... need to use... What might we need to use? Do we need to swap the cubes, maybe? Potentially? Possibly? Well, either way... Oh dear. Well, I guess that's one way to get the cube down, isn't it? Oh, oh, holy crap, what? Nope, stop! What are you doing, Steam? What are you doing, Portal 2? I don't know why the game just lagged so much there, but it must have been doing something important in the background. Maybe we do need to swap the cubes. Maybe that's exactly... The issue is that both of these funnels come in this direction, and we want both of the cubes over there. Interesting. Very interesting. This user never turns off, right? 
Yes, this fizzler appears to be permanently turned on. We can't get over there... in this state. Well, isn't that great? Wait, what if... Yeah, okay. So... We do this... Aha! And Then what? No, I don't want to go in that direction. Uh, hmm. Well, we're closer here now, we're- we're in a position we couldn't traditionally reach before. There's not a way to upset the balance of that cube, is there? Doesn't seem to be. This might be a bad situation to be in, now that I think about it. It might be that this isn't what we need to do. Oh! I see what I should've done. Aha! Yes, I'm being dumb. So now, we just do this. And this. Ta-da! And that gets us over there. I'm bad with funnels, but not that bad. Not that bad. Right. So let's save, because this is a easy to restore position. I mean easy to restore from. What do we want to do here? Interesting. What would we use the light bridge for? And do we want to swap the cubes... in any capacity? Cubes can't fit through this gap, so... that's out of the question. Let's try bringing both cubes out here, first of all. I can put this cube here, and then I can respawn the other one. That works. Oh, hmm. Yes. Good point. Good point. Good point. And that fizzler never turns off. Well, the what? Did the music just stop? Why did that happen? What? Interesting. Oh, it's playing this part again? I wonder what caused that to happen. Weird.
Well, either way, I need to reload my save, because I've done messed up. So, let's consider how things are like this. That fizzler never turns off. But maybe we don't need it to. Maybe. Just maybe. Right, so. We can't take this cube anywhere. Yep. Yep. Well, that's interesting. So. That's clearly not it. But we can walk in here... And... not do much. Am I going crazy? No, because this light bridge turns off when I turn off the fizzler. Right, okay, so... But I still might be going crazy, even despite that. That works. <laughs> I could press the button, but, uh, you know. Yeah, this isn't gonna work. So, let's try something else. We could... respawn this cube into the funnel... and stand on the button ourselves. That could work. Let's try it. Let's see where it takes the cube. I'm pretty sure it'll take it to that portal surface there. That seems to be happening. Maybe that is how we start the cube swap. Yeah, so now it's dropped. And then we need to respawn... the companion cube, right? There's no other buttons in there, right? Yeah, it's just that one button that the companion cube's on. So we can put the regular cube on it instead. Where do we put the companion cube, though? I'll just leave it here for now. Let's see what happens when we do this. Oh! Come on! Come on, Val! Please behave. Hmm. That's a thing we can do, but it's not particularly useful.
Though, I wonder... Oh, yeah. <laughs> it just... yeah, okay. What at? What if it goes... Oh! It goes this way. Really. Um... Crap, what am I gonna do about that? Uh, hmm... Yes, I do seem to have made a miscalculation... ...in my judgment. What's the best way to get that now? I would have to take that off, wouldn't I? But... to do that... I would need to respawn it... via the button in here. And that would just make it drop over and over, wouldn't it? Oh, but then... I think... I think I've done it. I think I'm just... thinking about stuff for no reason. No, now I can't shoot that! Not that it would help, anyway. Well, we have this cube here now, right? And we still haven't used... ...this button yet. This still perplexes me. I feel like we're really close. Really close. Because I have the companion cube in here, and I have the regular cube in here, I just can't get the regular cube in my hands. Let's try this. Because this allows us to get back in here, if we mess up. Wait, is it really just simple? Is this all I needed to do? Wow, I was overcomplicating things. Oh yeah, wow, holy crap. <laughs> I thought there was a bit more to it than that, but wow, that's a good map, Hugo. Very nice work. Ta-da! Very nice map, Hugo. I really like that a lot. Alright. Well guys, as always, thank you so much for watching, I really appreciate it, and I'll see you all in another video. Goodbye!